do you feel now that it was all worth it and that you coming out and speaking the way you have and campaigning the way you have has ensured that what happened to you will never happen again to another woman? Are you confident now in our health system? I wouldn't say I'm 100% confident in it yet, but we're getting there. Um, I, I, am, I am glad, absolutely. I think it was the right decision to make. Um, I often wonder if I wasn't as sick as what I was, would I have made that decision? I think sometimes, you know, if, if, if you're at the end of the rope, which I was, and I didn't think I was going to make it, I just thought, you know, you're backed into a corner, you know, you know you're very dangerous because you don't care. I was at the point where, you know, I don't care what happens here, you know, this can't happened to other women and all I knew at that time was there were 10 other women, you know, and I wanted to make sure that they found out. Um, but once I suppose the thing started taking kind of, you know, shape and I knew there was far more women and then, you know, Stephen contacted me and Gabriel Skelly um, was brought on board. I could see that things were changing and I thought, well, I have to keep at this, you know, and I will keep at this. I will keep at this until we get to a point where we have a screening programme we can trust.